Hey, how's it going guys? This is Dave2D and welcome to episode five of my laptop setup, a series where I feature the gear that you guys submit as well as showcase whatever it is that you do with your laptop. So this episode is featuring gamers. Now I do a lot of gaming laptop coverage on this channel, so it's no surprise that there's gonna be some gamer episodes. This is the first of hopefully many. First, we have a submission from Chris. His setup includes an Alienware 17 and some Corsair gear. So the Corsair MouseMate MM200 mouse pad and a Corsair Sabre gaming mouse. That has full RGB lighting and it's around $50, so it's actually a pretty solid mouse for the price. The headphone he uses are the Sennheiser Urbanite XL and the phone he uses is a Xiaomi Mi 5 or Mi 5. I'm not sure how to pronounce it, but I thought that was a Samsung S6 at first because that curved back. So he goes to school for computer engineering and it looks like he's a Linux user and he works with C in Visual Studio. And of course he's a gamer. So the clip he submitted is from Tom Clancy's The Division. So this was a game that was really hyped at launch. I almost did an OMG setup for it. It's an online open world third person shooter and it's a lot of fun, especially if you have friends to play with. Nowadays the servers are a little less busy so it's not quite the same feeling as the original game, but yeah, it's a pretty solid game and it looks like Chris is pretty good at it. The next setup is from Edward. He's also a student. His pack is the Everlane Modern Snap Backpack. His laptop is the Gold XPS 13. And if you've seen my review of it, it's the most powerful XPS 13 with the HD 540 graphics card. Instead of a mouse, he uses a PS4 controller for most of his gaming. The headphones he uses are the V Moda M100s. For his phone, he's rocking a OnePlus One, so this is the OG OnePlus. And he also uses this pencil, the Pentel Graph Gear 1000. Now, I normally wouldn't showcase a pencil in this series, but it's actually the same pencil that I use, and it's actually my favorite mechanical pencil. I picked it up in Japan, it's an awesome pencil, like 10 out of 10 would recommend. If you're looking for a mechanical pencil, this has absolutely nothing to do with tech, but this is a really good one. He submitted a clip from Bioshock, and that's a first person shooter with what I consider to be the best story I've ever seen in a first person shooter game. And there's also some kind of RPG. I'm actually not sure what game this is, uh, but it's neat that he plays these games with a controller and not a mouse. The last setup is from Sean. So he's using a camo version of the AORUS X5S. I've never done a full review of that laptop, but I think it's one of the most technically impressive laptops on the market. There's room for 64 gigs of RAM. There are four separate drive bays. It can fit a GTX 980M and it's relatively thin and light. It's a beast. The V6 is coming out soon with the GTX 1070 and I'll likely do a review of that one. He's got a pack from Solo and he uses a Swiss gear sleeve to protect the laptop. He also has a Logitech G240 mouse pad and a G900 wireless mouse. So this mouse is arguably the best performing wireless gaming mouse on the market right now. For audio, he uses a pair of MoFi headphones from Blue. Those are more of an audiophile set of headphones. He also uses a pair of wireless JBL earbuds. And when he wants to amp it up, he uses the TDK A33, which is a wireless Bluetooth speaker that's weatherproof. So Sean submitted a clip of himself playing Planet Side 2. That's a free to play MMO shooter. Lots of fun, I used to play that thing obsessively, but the frame rates of this recording are a bit choppy for his laptop, I'm not sure why. Possibly because it was filmed with fraps, that thing is kind of resource hungry. Just a piece of advice for anyone else who wants to submit gameplay footage, use Shadowplay if you can. It's only for Nvidia cards, but it's free. It's very light on resources and the image quality is really good. I definitely prefer Shadowplay over Fraps right now. But that's the end of this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you want to submit your own content, check the video description below. There's full instructions there. If you're a gamer and you feel like you kind of missed the boat for this episode, don't worry. There's a lot of gamers out there. There's going to be future gaming episodes. I will do my best to include all of you that I can. Thumbs if you liked this video, subs if you loved it. It's been nice. I'll see you guys next time.